it's me again the real jenny land and today i am going to hit you with a two-part uh one of the kevin samuels phone calls so if this is something that you're interested in just keep watching hello all right you you've been here before okay yeah okay so what do you okay so i've seen you on was it on instagram all right, so I, I have this thing where I don't have people continue to always call back. So you got something? What you got on the top? In my opinion, I don't think the majority of women want traditional relationships. They want modern situationships. I'm actually going to have to agree with her on that. I do feel a lot of women want guys to be a lot more traditional, um, but the modern woman, I don't think really wants to reciprocate. Okay. Because um, for one, most of them really don't even know what it takes to withhold a long-term relationship. And how old are you, by the way? Uh, 29. And were you married? Yes. <laughs> I, I mean, are you married? That's what I'm asking. Currently, no. Okay. Uh, you were married, though. Yes. Any children? Yes. How many? Two. By the, by the same guy or di different guys? No, different. All right. And do you want to be married? I mean, I would love to be married. Um, but? I have to see what is looking for me. <laughs> okay, that is a red flag. If a person says they have to see what is looking for them, that means that they do not have a type. Okay. Hi. Hi. And what's your name, sweet child? I'm Cindy. Cindy. Oh. oh, but the resemblance is striking. Look at the same oh. cheekbones oh. and the same lips. Same, same mm. eyes. Look at your hair. And, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> You've got the same nose. <laughs> tickle, tickle. Beep, boop. I, I, I feel like I've done a lot of work towards getting ready for marriage. Okay. But I'm only one part of the puzzle piece, and I can only try to fit his piece by looking at generalizations. What does that mean? Meaning I could try to prepare myself for him in a manner in which I'm preparing myself for kind of like the general male. And then, you know, everybody got their preferences after that, things he likes and mm -hmm. stuff like that that you cater to and, you know. Are you are you seeing anybody seriously? No. I hate how she said that like that's a bad thing. Like, what's wrong with a woman being single and happy? She said that like it's like the end of the world. Child, please. Okay. What was your last relationship? Uh, over a year ago. Okay. Probably like a year and a half now. And why didn't you? Uh, were you married to either one of your children's fathers? No. I was engaged to one of them, the youngest one, um, but apparently it didn't happen. <laughs> so, okay, so you have children, but you weren't engaged to the fathers of the children. And right now, you say you're not serious. You, you're. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get. I don't gain. have. I don't have any serious prospects because I. The type of man I I go for, like mentality wise, I haven't necessarily been able to get one at my pace what do you mean near me i'm in kentucky so what do you mean the type of man you go for mentality wise um it's not I've a word come across a lot of betas i haven't really been able to come across um a surplus of alphas actual alphas meaning responsible dominance not in irresponsible dominance because man I started having a problem right here when we talk about alpha, beta. I'm just be honest. 
where your children are sired by alpha males? No. Then why the hell would an alpha male want to raise beta children? I understand that, but I also believe so, that. So, 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 if you reproduce for betas by your own estimation, why do you all of a sudden get an alpha? Responsible and all these other things once you've had beta kids. I thought his dad was, I thought my son's dad was an alpha. I don't, okay. don't recall our conversation, but my first I remember, child, I was. Okay. I, I remember, but what I'm saying is it doesn't matter what you thought. What matters is you, what women seem to it now. No, what the problem is, the women seem to think. He said that as if, if you start off dating one type of guy, then that's the only type of guy that you have to date, which that's not true. Think that you can get better than your child's father. You you get no, in general, you don't get higher than the man you reproduce with. And you can. Ladies, don't let a man tell you that you can't do better than your child's dad. Because that is absolutely not true. So when I hear any woman coming in talking about they want a higher level of man as they're older, more use, and someone else's children, that goes completely opposite of market dynamics. I understand. I also believe, I'm not one of those chicks that believe that you can't discipline my kids or anything when it comes to like certain Ma things. Ma'am, the the ma it's life. not a matter of disciplining. You said you can't find men mentality wise for you as if you are here and they are here as if you're above them you huh as okay so when she talked about mentality wise i didn't think that she thought that she was here and guys were here i thought that she meant like she wants to meet a man that's not just trying to sleep with her but actually stay around to move into a direction of having a family who's on your mental level as far as drive all right um, drive as far as what um like drive to family success but i thought she meant drive to family success as far as like having a, a serious family what do you do um, for a living i'm a homemaker uh, say again a homemaker you you're in construction? No, I'm I I take care of my kids in my home. I'm a stay at home mom. How do you stay at home mom without a husband? Cuz I Okay, so ladies, if you are not working and you have children and you are not married, you are an unemployed single mother. Let's just Keep it real. Idiot woman. How you stay at home mom without a husband? Who's making, who's, who, who's, 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 where does the money come from? Well, the, my kids are, the, their fathers are financially responsible for them. So that takes So in other money. words, you got beta, you got beta male's children, but you, they do so well providing that you can stay at home so, and be a, stay-at-home mom off the surplus of these beta males. No, they are forced to be res financially responsible. I don't care if they're forced or not. Uh, what I'm hearing is a woman who stays at home who has no husband, and I'm asking how is this possible? And guys, stop letting the state take care of your kids. Just be a responsible father and take care of your kids on your own. If you don't want to be responsible for children, Either make sure the lady is using birth control or you, you know, cover it up. Put your rain caps on, gentlemen. <laughs> I'm trying to explain it to you in a in a way that's simple. Um, my lifestyle in total, and I actually Ain't calculated nobody got time all for my that. bills and everything in the yearly total. With both of my kids, I really don't even have to go over $25,000 a year. Hmm. Okay, so we're just we're just barely getting by. Both your kids, twenty five. No, I'm not barely getting by on anything. My kids have oh. a surplus of things, and they're very well taken Ooh, care Lord, of. No, that's not the point. Okay, so 
<sighs> I'm not knocking anyone at all, but I feel like one thing she should not be focused on right now is getting a man. Um, I think that sh her goal should either be getting into someone's college, going to a trade school, or trying to get a, at least a job because I just feel like child support is not going to be there forever and what are you going to do once the child support is over I'm not sure how old her kids are but it just seems like a man shouldn't be the focus right now it should be on improvement of herself and I know the trolls are going to say she's 29 she should be focusing on getting a husband no she needs to focus on her life goals Oh, that's the point I was making. I'm sorry, I missed it. I'm just trying to understand that how a woman comes in saying, and and why are we at cross purposes right now is because when you start coming in talking about the kind and caliber of men around you, then I'm going to start sticking up for men because that happens far yeah. too often. Women I are understand. well because so I'm going to try to understand the caliber of woman you are because that's fair. You said they're not a lot of men mentality wise on your level in Kentucky, and I'm trying to understand mentality wise who I'm talking to. And what I'm listening to is a woman who has two children by two different men who you say are not alphas, so they're by definition betas or less than alpha, but they do well enough, whether they're required to or not, they do well enough to where you can sit on your natural ass at home. I'm kind of, I always get a little bit confused when people call into his show because she doesn't seem like she's looking for a high value man. She seems like she's just looking for a man. And if I can pick up on that, I want to know why Kevin Samuels hasn't picked up on that. Let's keep watching. Ass at home and not have to work and be a housewife to no husband. And you wonder why you can't find an alpha? No, they don't, they don't, they, I'm, there's laws here that will pay their child support. For I don't care about all that. I don't care about those details, oh. man. I'm just, I don't care about those. I, and the point is, you said you wonder why you can't find any alpha males. I haven't found a man who has been able to take the husband role to allow me to be the wife. They don't see you is why you can't find them. Yeah, I was in a three-year relationship. Of, like, all my relationships are long, so... When I'm out there on the market, I find a dude that has qualities that I like, and I try with that, and I try to make that work. Did you hear what I said? The kind of man you're talking they about, see. they don't see you. Yeah, you, you're not you're not on their level. Just like you I, say, the, just like you, just like you can make a level to say those, though you can't find men on your level mentality wise. Men can say that you ain't on their level. Yes, they very well can. And I'm saying the kind of man you're referring to, you're not on their level. He sh there's no point of even saying that. I mean, I feel like right now all you're doing is kicking her while she's down because clearly she is down. <laughs> Are you saying that I shouldn't have a man who wants to provide for his family? Or I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying what. I mean, man, I don't. Not, I don't really have high standards. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I, check, check it, check that shit. Ladies, never, ever, ever, ever say that you don't have high standards. Basically, if you say that you don't have high standards, that means that you will deal with anything. Like, why aren't your standards higher? Okay. Come by here. I'm not saying what you should or should not do. I'm just saying that when you say that you can't find men on your level, fair. But are you on the level to where the, are you on the level as to where the men you want is the question. And apparently you're not because you can't seem to find them. Do they exist? That's what I'm trying to find i've been well they, so they exist ma'am because these kind of men exist everywhere the thing is they tend to want something that's the disconnect all so many women tend to think that they are higher value women than they really are what she look like again she looks like layla ali layla ali <laughs> i told you come on now we got this thank you for helping me today that wasn't nothing, boo. I told you I got this. Mm -hmm. I told you we should have helped her. You ain't want to help me. Hey, y'all. Oh, you have to go on the table. I'm waiting for Layla. 
Oh, you so silly. Hey, sister. What the fuck? Which one of these fine ass men is coffee? That one right there. Hi, coffee. Two coffees to go, please. Yeah. Ooh, so what should I give? Like, I, I, I look at a lot of your stuff, and to be honest, I agree with like all the. But so where would you rank your? How about this? About forty something. What would you rank yourself? Stuff. What would you rank yourself on the sexual marketplace? Let's do that. What would you rank yourself from the sexual market? Okay, so a person that says they don't have uh, high standards, why would you think that they have even thought about where they would rank anywhere? Like, I mean, she's already said that you know she's not working. Um, she's, uh, unmarried. She's not in a relationship. So like, why, I mean, why is ranking herself something that would even be important to her or should even be a question? I don't really get it. Do that. What would you rank yourself from the sexual marketplace value? Where would you rank yourself? So how, how tall are you? Uh, about six, about five, 11, six feet. Dress size? I would probably have to get it tailored because of my bust. Dress but, size? Um, 14. How much did you weigh the last time you weighed yourself? 10 going down. I mean, yeah, I'm big. I've been losing weight. The little frumpy dumpy music is so disrespectful to me. That's why I said I feel like he does not have much respect for women at all. I've been losing weight. Okay. I was I was all trying right. to gain uh, weight. Okay, uh, uh, ma'am, let me get on to no 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 no. I just okay. need to get on to the next things, ma'am. That's fine. You are what you are. Where would you rank your 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 looks? Fresh face, out of the shower, your own natural hair, no makeup. Scale to zero to ten, a one to ten. You cannot use seven. Somewhere between a four and a half to an adjustable six. That's a big range. You got to give yourself a range. I mean, it's not. It's not. Yeah, there's no ranges. Five. I'm asking you, ma'am. I'm just asking you. You said what? Well, I'm trying to like if I judge myself, or I judge myself from the perception of a male. I like, like okay. I think like a male might say that I'm like a five, but I feel like I'm a digestible six. Okay. Um, and how old are you? Twenty nine. All right. Uh, I would give you a five. You're not an adjustable six because that will put you on the same. Can we talk about this for a second? He says sweetie is a six. I'm not a man, so maybe I don't know how to judge women. Sweetie to me would be an eight and a half or a nine. Um, if he thinks sweetie is a six, then he should think that this woman is a one because sweetie is absolutely gorgeous. I want the man in the comment section because I guess you guys know. Um, what, tell me, I'm going to put a picture of sweetie up somewhere in here. What do you guys rank sweetie as? You're average yes. looking. You're average looking. You're not, that's not bad, but you could obviously, even from a physical oh, standpoint... Excuse me. <laughs> I can lose some weight, make someone. No, you can. Yeah, of course. Yes. So, so in and what? I'm on that road. Hold on, don't no. See, so in what world do women who are average from an from a from a look standpoint and below average from a physicality standpoint get an above average man? Well. I understand. I might not be able to. I know sometimes, and I'm not trying to use your words, but um, I've gathered that guys. Can you answer my question before you get into? I said, all right. I didn't even put in the children. And what is it the norm that an average looking woman with a below average physique can get an above average man? No, it's, right. it's it's uncommon for the first point. So what you're listen, face. listen, listen, because you're not seeming to be able to get what it is you want or see it. And I'm telling you, it's because it's exceedingly uncommon for what you present. And that's that's not even including the one, two children. So what it is, is you're looking for something that's above your SMV. 
I don't have high standards for what I'm looking for as far as like, it's a mentality thing. I'm not, it's not really- But a mentality hard. tends to also come with an execution. You don't tend to find many productive, competitive, successful, alpha-minded males who are unsuccessful. They tend to have a above average level of- Again, she does not have high standards. So basically she just wants a man. She's not looking for a Lance Gross. She's looking for someone to be with her and wants to be in a relationship with her. Um, so that's the reason why I don't understand why, like if Kevin Samuels wants to take more of these calls, that's fine. This is his platform. He can do what he wants on his platform. But it's clear she's not looking for a high value man. She's not looking for an Adonis. She's just looking for a man. And one thing, women, I want you guys to like, just stop being uh, desperate. I just feel like this woman should do a little bit of work on herself. She seems like she's a really nice, sweet person, but stop just focusing on having a man. I have to have a man. It just screams desperation. Above average level of success. Okay, so calculate. Is that and no, no? Do you understand that? Yes. It's I not do. like you can say I don't have. I didn't say you want a millionaire, but you still want a man who's an above average kind of man. No matter how you slice it, whether it's income, whether it's mindset, he's not average. Would you accept that? To my experience, yes. What'd you say? I said yes to my experience. Why is she shaking her head saying yes when all of the stuff that she said to me is saying that she wants a below average man or maybe a below below average man, not even an average man. Average. Yeah, it's not what I'm used to. No. Exactly. It's above not what you're used to. You Stop overcomplicating it. Would you accept no, the kind of the answer is no. See, when women start doing all this talking and shit, they know they're wrong. I'm actually going to stop the video there. This is going to be part one. Um, make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe because there is going to be a part two posted very soon, maybe in a day or so. That way you guys can see the conclusion of this conversation. Uh -huh.